yeah he's using it to bolt I ended up making him halt or using it to make him halt for example the horse is using a certain move with his neck like pulling giving in leaning and so on to bolt to buck to rear up and do something forward charge forward and make him lose control over him your correct reaction to this action he did with his neck makes him do the complete opposite you wanted to bolt or buck forward he ended up stopping and moving back because of your correct hand reaction he wanted to change his direction suddenly and make you lose your balance because of your correct hand reaction you made him stop and go towards the scary thing or the spooky thing he's afraid of instead of moving away from it and so on so the thing he wanted to use to bolt was used by you with a correct hand reaction that made him halt and do the complete opposite. The same goes for the things that uh, happen around the horse and make him do something you don't want him to do. For example, he was afraid of a car or another animal or so on and he wanted to bolt away from it or rear up away from it or buck away from it or change his direction away from it. Your reaction towards it in the right way made him go to it instead of moving away from it. So it's all about an action the horse does to do a certain move or a certain thing he wants to achieve or do. If your reaction to it was correct, you will end up controlling him in that move and making him do the complete opposite. If your reaction to it was wrong, he will end up actually doing it against you or using it against you. So, he did something to bolt. My correct reaction to it made him halt.